Good morning, children. Today we are going to learn a lesson about sports. Do you like sports? Yes, everybody likes sports. In this chapter, we are going to learn about judo. What is a judo? A sports where one tries to unbalance the opponents by using arms and legs. This is known as judo. A martial art. Let's see glossary. Passion is strong emotion. Passion means strong emotion. Inspiration, mentally stimulated to do something creative. Inspiration, mentally stimulated to do something creative. Wondered, to think with a feeling of surprise. Wondered, to think with a feeling of surprise. Excel, exceptionally good. Excel, exceptionally good. Ridiculed, teased. Ridiculed, teased. Now, let's move on to the chapter. The strength in his weakness is the story we are going to learn today. Akilan is the main character of this story. He was an active and energetic boy. He loves sports as much as studies. So, he concentrated in both studies and sports. Sports and studies were like his eyes. He had a passion for sports. Always he wants to be a topper. Akilin always remember his father's words, learn well, live well. And his great inspiration was his physical education teacher. The teacher was good at judo, so he had a passion for learning judo. Akilin was afraid that his passion for judo may upset his parents. Finally, he decided and told his parents about his passion towards judo and also showed the medals he won. His parents were very surprised on seeing the medals and certificates that he won in school. After a few months, Akilan met with an accident and he lost his hand, left hand. So he was very much worried and he did not go out of his house. He always stayed in the corner of his house. His parents also was very much worried about their son. See, they were thinking that they cannot do anything for their son. Because he likes judo very much. With one hand, how can he participate? This was their very big question arise by the parents and the and Akilan. Fortunately, Akilan's father came across an advertisement of a judo school. So, when he said about the school to Akilan, he was energized and he asked his father whether he could be admitted in the judo school. Then Akilan was admitted in the school and his master was a, the best judo teacher in the town. His master trained him the basics before teaching the advanced skills. Everyone wondered how a boy with one arm could master judo. Akilan learned and practiced consistently for two years. He practiced only a single stroke for two years. Then, for the surprise and annoyed, as his master taught him only one stroke, but soon he mastered the stroke. No one could excel him in that stroke. He was very good in that stroke. To everyone's surprise, Akilan was picked by the master for national judo competition. Everyone teased Akilan and his master as they were not sure how a boy with one hand could win a national competition. To everyone's surprise, Akilan easily defeated all his six contenders, that is participants with his single stroke. Akilan reached the finals. Then could not believe that he was in the finals. The final may had begun and it had a total of six rounds. The opponent was very strong and defeated Akilan easily in the first two rounds. Now Akilan's master rushed to him and said, Believe yourself. The key to success is to focus on your strengths and not your weakness. So with this energetic words, Akilan felt some new energy rushing through him. So he did not want to lose his, this match. So Akilan understood the hidden hint his master gave him. So with these words, Akilan felt somewhat strengthened. So he believed on his single stroke and not on the strength of the opponent. Bum, bum, bum. Four strokes and four knockouts. Akilan had 
won the finals he was the champion now akilan thanked his master for training him and for believing in him now he had a curiosity and he asked his master how did he win the competition with a single stroke then his master told him you learn the most difficult stroke in judo that very few can master if your opponent wants to beat you they should hold your left hand this is the secret behind your victory so always believe in yourself believing in yourself is the best secret to success if you believe in yourself anything is possible so children will power is very important so believe in yourself and read practice right I hope you understood this lesson. Thank you children.